Hey, 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 how's it going? I'm gonna open my BoxyCharm, but I was gonna put on my skincare first so I can just let it set and absorb and have my skin love all the yummy goodness. This is the Lumi Radiance line. I love it because it helps brighten and even my skin tone and it has SPF 22, which I feel is important, okay? I then, this is like the whole process I do every morning. But I have oily skin and my skincare is really helping it, but this just gives me a really flawless finish. And then I promise I'm gonna open my BoxyCharm. You guys, I haven't even opened it. It's been sitting on my table for days and um, yeah, I haven't opened it yet. I'm a mess, I know this. Um, but yesterday we kind of had a disaster in the camper. Um, I've been posting updates about the camper on Instagram. Um, so if you want to, see all of those things they're over there so tell me what you guys are doing today uh, we unfortunately have to grocery shop which i am not excited about at all good morning good morning um i literally despise grocery shopping despise it okay i do those four steps before my foundation every single morning in that order moisturizer setting powder primer setting spray it just makes my foundation look completely flawless and amazing. But let's get to the boxy charm. Um, so we have grocery shopping and camper fixing today. You guys, more water. It's kind of a mess. Okay. There's kind of a disaster going here. I really need to clean my makeup table and do all my brushes. Okay, this is weird. Oh, look. It always comes with a card and it tells you what comes in it. Oh, I got a new mascara. We can try that out. Lime Crime Eyeshadow Palette. Beauty Maven Rose Water Setting Spray. Oh, I want to try that. A Hydrating Lip Oil. I love the lip oils that I get in here. And a Wet Brush Cleaning System. This is intriguing me. It's right on top. It's a Wet Brush Cleaning System. What's it say? A convenient brush cleaning system to quickly and easily remove makeup residue from cosmetic brushes. A textured silicone pad stores nicely inside the container. This is just weird to me. Slinging bling today. How fun, how fun. I'm going to have to get rid of so much of my jewelry. I literally don't know what this is. Wet brush cleaning system. I have no idea. We're going to have to do some research on that. <laughs> because I don't have a clue. I don't know what that is. Okay. So here is the Rose Water Setting Spray by Beauty Maven. I'm really excited about this. I'm definitely gonna keep it. I'm just gonna throw that out there. Let's just spray it on because I wanna smell it. Let's see if it really smells like rose water. Oh my gosh, this smells divine. Ooh, I like that. Rose Water Setting Spray. Okay, yeah, keeping that. A lot of this stuff I've given to my kids. Um. Ooh, the lip oil. I really, look, it's in a big container. So I have to get rid of so much of my jewelry because I have bought so much. Oh my gosh, this is like huge. You guys, it's like huge. Ooh, it smells like coconut. Oh yeah. Oh, I like this one better than the other one because it has the wand. Mmm. This is Divine also. This is from KAB Cosmetics. Mmm. Non-sticky. Instant burst of hydration. Comes in six different tints. Mine looks clear for sure. I don't know. I don't know. I'm pretty excited about that too. Venus 3. This is the Lime Crime Palette. Maybe we should try it today. I don't know. I mean, I'm just going to the grocery store. I don't know if I can. Oh my gosh. I thought it was going to be greens. You guys. That is gorgeous. We're going to play with that today. That's amazing. I love that. Okay. And then we got the Damn Girl by Too Faced Mascara. And I'm going to try it today. Because, well, why not? For shamelessly thick and curled lashes. 97% said they saw full on volume. 100% said they saw intense black lashes. So let's see how much this is. $26. If I'm being honest, I'm probably not going to pay $26 for um, mascara, right? Because, well, I know that I can get my Zen for 
like four bucks, right? Because I get half off. Um, I love the Extreme Curl. I love the Limitless. All of that, I get half off. So even the Limitless is 24, I get for 12. So honestly, I'm probably not gonna ever buy this again. But I can appreciate the boxy charm because it's just fun and I get to try some new things and I get to compare them to my pharmacy stuff. Okay, so I was going to actually do the VFX foundation, but I think I'm still having to mix because I had I never bought the 03 because I'm a slacker. So let's just try to put it on maybe and then put the other shade on. <laughs> oh. Um and then we'll I, I'm really excited to play with some of my new boxy charm stuff. We'll put the lighter color on my nose, right? Okay, let's just get a brush and mix it together, kind of. Yeah, that'll work, that's perfect. That's perfect, yeah. I need to get a tan. What's going on with my lighting here? I don't know. Um, I need to get a tan so that I can go back up to the one foundation um, so that I don't have to buy the other one because I don't really wanna buy the other one because I just know that I'm gonna get tan soon. This is our VFX. I don't wear this a lot, you guys, but I really do love it um, because it makes you look amazing in pictures. <laughs> so if you have somewhere special that you're, something special that you're doing and you know you're gonna want pictures, wear this VFX because it has a photo filter technology that is just, I don't know, amazing. Okay, I need more, but now I've gotta mix it again. Oh gosh, you guys, I'm kind of a mess. I'm not even gonna lie. Um, and I'm probably gonna this all in my hair. I need to remember to buy the 03. And I put in 100 orders since I changed colors. And I typically just don't wear this foundation because I haven't ordered the right color. Because then I think, well, summer's almost here. I'm gonna get a tan. You guys, I love the way this looks so much. Oh, I just hit my elbow on the, on the cleaning system that I cannot figure out at all. Okay, let me see a mirror. Does this have a mirror? Oh, it does have a mirror. I think I want to take my blending bud. Oh, this cat. Okay, so this cat thinks that I should feed it every morning and every day whenever I get home. There are other people here, but it thinks I should feed it. It literally has a bowl full of food right now, but I haven't fed it yet this morning. Ella, stop. And Bridget is sitting in the doorway. Like, you're not coming in here because you're annoying. <laughs> okay. There we go. So there's that foundation. I really love the coverage of it. I love the way it looks. Yeah, I really like it a lot. Let's do a little concealer. I need to check the tracking of my box because I've ordered some new concealer, but I haven't got it yet. And I literally think I ordered like three of them. And here's why I can do that. Like, I would have never done that before. But this concealer is $9.90. And so my shipping rate is different than customer shipping rate. So it's a little higher. So I like to order lots of things all at once. This is really running out. It's really sad right now. Um, but so I ordered three. But here's the thing. It's only $9.90 and I paid $4.45 for them. So why not get three, right? <laughs> do you guys do that? Here's the thing for me too, is except for pharmacy, I hate paying shipping. Like the only reason why I can pay shipping with um, pharmacy is because the products are so affordable, right? So I feel like even with my higher shipping, like $6.99, um, yours is only $4.99, which I don't get that, but whatever. Um, I love this lip oil. It's very pretty. Um, I forgot what I was saying, you guys. Um... I saw my, that shiny on my lip and I was like, ooh, I really like that. Okay, I'm gonna set this, my makeup really good today because it's raining outside and I want it to look really perfect. I don't even know why I'm doing my makeup, probably because Kyle was doing something else so I thought I had time and I really wanted to open up my BoxyCharm. Okay. Look how smooth that under eye looks though. I like it a lot. Okay, I'm gonna set the rest of my face with just some BB powder. Guys, I got this brush. 
and I love all the other pharmacy brushes and this one's so cute but like the bristles are always falling out it came in like a set I earned it you got the same one and the lip oil the lip oil is amazing um, I really like it and I'm gonna play with this palette here in a minute um, I really love my BoxyCharm a lot. I am going to be canceling it because, well, Kyle and I hopefully are quitting our full-time job soon and living in the camper, right? So I feel like I need to budget better and not get frivolous things that generally speaking, I honestly just usually give them away because, well, um, like I'm going to try this Too Faced Mascara, but then I'm probably gonna like my pharmacy better. <laughs> or I'll use this for a minute and then yeah. I do love it because it's like a nice surprise every month. Um, so I love that about it. It's like a present to myself. Like I feel like someone's buying me a present and it's, well, it's me, but you know what I mean. Like it's just like, I get it and I am so excited when it comes to the mail. I was so excited the other day and I didn't open it so that I could open it with you guys, and then I kept forgetting it on the table. It is super cheap, and you get tons of really great stuff, for sure, but it's like, I'm not getting the things I need, right? Like, it's, I think, I feel like it's the fun, like, icing stuff. Like, I don't get, like, a lot of great skincare in it, or foundations, or concealers, or things like that. I'm ready for them to send me some bronzers. Like, summer's coming up. You're going to need to send me some bronzers. Um, pharmacy discontinued theirs, which is, makes me sad. Um, but my BoxyCharm, I think it's like $26 or something. But I get five full-size products. And I usually give half of them away. <laughs> Because, well, I'm not going to wear them. Well, some of it, like the um, tinted moisturizer thing that I got, I didn't love. Like the coverage wasn't great and it was just kind of like, eh. Like it felt oily and I didn't love it. Which, here's the thing, is I love getting stuff like that and deciding. Because here's the deal, is before Unique, I didn't wear makeup. So then once I started wearing Unique, I just thought it was the best and only kind out, right? Like, there was no better kind of makeup than that kind because I'd never tried anything else. And then I tried other primers that my, because my daughter got BoxyCharm for a while and she, so she said, try this primer. It's so amazing. And I was like, okay, so that's what primer is supposed to feel like. It's not supposed to feel slick and oily and heavy, right? So then with pharmacy, I got to try so many more things and I loved it, but with BoxyCharm, then I still get to really try different things and kind of compare. So like, the tinted moisturizer that I got, I felt like it was crappy. And if I want a tinted moisturizer, I'll just use the BB cream because it's so much better. Um, I just like the coverage of it. Because I guess here's the deal. is like my daughter probably is in love with that tinted moisturizer I gave her, right? But she's young. She has flawless skin. She has all the things. And I just feel like for me, even a tinted moisturizer when I want a lighter coverage, it still has to have coverage, right? Because I'm old. I'm fine with it. I'm happy with it, but you get what I mean, right? So I don't know. It gives me the chance to try so many things and to see what I really love about pharmacy and then some things that I'm just like, eh, it's okay. Right? I haven't really found anything that I'm like, oh, that's way better. I am excited to try this setting spray because it's a rose water one. And I think that's super fancy and neat. I'm just kind of carving out my brows just a little bit. But, um, oh no, I lost my brow brush. I actually did get a brush the other day from um, a website because it was a dollar. And I was like, hmm, I wonder if I'm going to like this. I want to see. And, um, it was really amazing and it was a dollar. I'm like, okay, so now I got to try more from there. Okay, so it just kind of cleans it up just a little bit. So your brows don't have to be perfect if you're kind of carving them out a little bit. So nothing super crazy here, but I do really want to try. I'm going to go ahead and put this all over my lid. Um, 
this palette. Actually, I think I'm gonna do the eye primer because I want to, these colors to be awesome. Is this it? Yep. Ooh, I need to get another one of these. This is really getting low. This is the first one that I ever bought. So it's lasted me a long time for sure. Um, a lot of people use it for under eye coverage, which I think is pretty incredible. I don't have a lot to cover, so I've tried to do like the one side with and one. It does, it does change some, especially with this eye with that crease right there. I'll have to show it to you sometime this week, maybe. If there's something you guys want me to, oh, you know what? I'm showing you kids this week. Never mind. <laughs> Never mind. Maybe I'll throw it in, but maybe I'll throw it into my stories one day this week. You guys, I'm getting so excited about our camper living. Um, and I just really hope that it's a little bit more smooth sailing. Um, because the whole process of redoing it has been super difficult. And we keep finding leaking water and now it's gonna rain like for the next three days and rained all day yesterday. And it's really just exhausting and defeating because yesterday our goal was to hang up my spice racks, which we didn't end up doing um, because I didn't have the silverware thing that I ordered. It won't be here till Monday. And um, so I wasn't, I didn't realize how I guess big everything was. I don't know. I don't know, you guys. It's just a lot right now. <laughs> so um, we found more water. We had to go to Home Depot yesterday and get more supplies. Like that wasn't a cheap fix because we had to get insulation. We They didn't have the wallboard stuff because it's so thin. Um, so we have to get that maybe at a lumber store, I guess, this week. He said maybe he's going to send me tomorrow. I have one more day off work. So I took some vacation um, last week because our doctor was out. And uh, I literally got nothing done because I was sick at the beginning of the week. If you guys don't follow me on TikTok, there are some things that I don't share on Facebook because Facebook people, like, know me, right? I'm um, like, I'll see you in Dollar General. And, um... I don't want to embarrass myself, right? There's not a whole lot of my personal friends that really follow me on TikTok, I don't feel like. So I can tell them more embarrassing stories. <laughs> it's kind of ridiculous, but um, last week I was very sick. <laughs> um, at the beginning, when the weather was like 70, um, I was very sick. And I just laid on the couch sick all week. Well, for about the first three days. And then by the time I got to feeling better, it was cold and rainy. And I hated that. You guys, I love blush everywhere. I don't know what's going on with my lighting. It's like the brushes are picking it up and doing something weird to it. Um, but, so yeah. So TikTok I save for embarrassing things. Instagram is camper stuff. And here is all the other life stuff. I'm trying to keep them different, but it's really hard because I'm not that interesting. You guys, I'm doing all of this just to go to the grocery store. Kyle's gonna be like, what are you doing? I'm like, I don't know. I'm doing all my makeup so I can put on a mask and go into the store. I even put on jeans, you guys. Today is day three. I'm still loving the Curlsmith products. Um, the curls are really defined and this is day three, y'all. That's crazy. Okay, let's play with this palette. Let's get rid of these foundations and do something with this palette it's so pretty oh my gosh this is so i need a trash can in here i had a box and it's really full oh my gosh you guys this is gorgeous i really want that purple all over my lid so that's what we're gonna do so let's see here flat brush you guys i have so many brushes but i need to clean my brushes because there is um a lot dirty like, I've used all these eye brushes, and I need to wash them, but I do still have a lot. Okay, so this is the purple color. This is the Lime Crime Venus 3 palette, and this is the Paradise color right there. We're going to try it. We're going to see how pigmented it is. Oh, I'm thinking it's going to be really pigmented. Maybe I shouldn't have got that much. It's fine. Okay, it's not terrible. 
I thought it was gonna be really crazy. And then I'm going to transition it out with a more neutral color, so then I feel like maybe only the lid is really bold, maybe? I don't know, we're gonna see. I'm not the greatest at eyeshadow. If you've watched me for a while, I've definitely come a long way, but I'm still not great at it. Kyle's in the shower, so I gotta hurry. But we're just packing it on. This cat is not gonna stop meowing until like I pretend to feed it. Do you hear it meowing? She's driving me insane. She doesn't like it when Dryden's not awake. So the fact that I wake up and then I probably wake her up with being up here, probably annoys her even more. Okay, so here's the deal. Do you see how this lid is so much bigger than this one? If you have that problem, just come up above it. So now we're just gonna kind of create our own lid above the crease so that it looks the same. See how it looks more the same? Even though you can kind of tell it's a little bit above it, once I think I blend it out, it will be okay. This color is amazing. But you can kind of do that if you have hooded eyes or if your creases are different like a mine. Okay, I need a fluffy brush. Let's do this one because it's a little smaller. This one is crown. This is definitely something that I got from BoxyCharm. Okay. I think I want to start with this one. It's Rapture. And we're going to take it and maybe I got too much. I don't know. I'm going to start at the outside, but I'm going to kind of just try to diffuse that line with that pink shimmer. I want to start lighter and then kind of go from there. This is such a pretty color. I don't know if you guys can see it. The pictures will definitely, I'll put up a picture in the comments when I'm done, but oh, it's so pretty, you guys. Just a little bit more, because I really like this. Definitely looks different, but it's not super bold at the top. So then I just poke it in there again and start on the outside. Cause then it'll kind of diffuse this edge too, where I put it above my crease, but no one will know. This is kind of iridescent -y, this top part. I might've should have chosen a matte, but again, I don't really know eyeshadow, so we're just trying to do the best that we can. Okay, okay. This is so pretty. I really love this a lot, okay? Now I'm gonna come in with this ecstasy color and just do a little bit. This is a really pigmented palette, like real pigmented. Um, just a little bit out here, just to kind of give it a little bit of depth and dimension out here in this outer corner. This is so pretty, you guys. I'm super impressed with this palette. Usually I use them once and then I put them to the side and you guys, I have so many palettes, it's ridiculous. It's really raining and really windy. Is it raining where you're at? Tell me what the weather is like where you're at. If you get it a little bit, just take your blending bud and kind of just clean it up a little bit. Um, it's raining and it's cold here. And I don't, I come coming back in with that pink color just to kind of diffuse and blend that outside edge. So you see how it's not super dark, but you see how it's different. We didn't go super bold on that outside, but you can take a dark color like that and put it on there. Just tap it off a little bit for any extra so you, cause you don't want fallout. And then basically what I'm gonna do out here is I'm just gonna kind of do like a triangle and then maybe diffuse it up into the crease a little bit. Okay, see how it gives you just that little bit of color but it's not like completely smoking it out or doing anything crazy with it. But it just gives that little bit of dimension there in that corner. And then I can come back in with the Rapture color and pop it in there, okay? 
So then though, I am gonna come in with the Beloved, just a really little bit under eye. I'm excited to try this mascara because I've been hearing about it for a minute and I know that whenever I was with Unique, I used the Unique mascara. Um, I liked it. I loved the 3D mascara. Um, they kind of kept changing the formula on us, but I still really, really liked it. Um, let's clean this brush. Well, we'll just put it right there. It's fine. Um, but a lot of people use the um, Too Faced Better Than Sex, and this is supposed to be better than that. It's a 24-hour mascara. I don't know who wears their mascara 24 hours, but people do, I guess. Very sunny and in the mid-50s. See, I love that. I love 50s and 60s. Oh, it's so nice. Okay. Let's try this beam color. See what it looks like in the center. It's pretty pink. I thought it would be more like a shimmery pink, but it's like, well, I mean, it's shimmery, but. Oh, that's really pretty though. Oh, you can't really see it. There you see the little bit up there. It's really pretty. Um, Earlier this week, we had 60s and up to even 70s. The house was open. It was so incredible. I absolutely loved it. I really think I wanna put this color on that lid too. Let's just pop it on one and see what it does. This is Beam. So there's the original Paradise color, and then there's Beam over. Oh yeah, it's pretty. It's so shimmery. Kyle's gonna be like, where are we going, babe? I'm gonna be like, the Aldi. <laughs> do you guys do this? Do you do, I didn't do my makeup yesterday, and usually on Saturdays and Sundays, I do just give my face a rest. I give my lashes a rest, my face a rest, and I just do my skincare because I think that it is important to let your skin breathe and to just learn to love yourself with or without makeup, which I love. Okay. I really like it. This palette is so pretty and I feel like you could do so many different things. Megan, this is from my boxy charm. It is lime crime. I thought it was gonna be greens because, well, you know, St. Patrick's Day, but no, it's like my favorite colors. And I literally love it so much. I'm gonna put a little bit more of this brown over here in this other corner, maybe. It's so pretty. I really love it. I love all the colors. I love all the things about this look. I don't even know. Um, I saw a girl on TikTok this morning and she had like a really bold berry look and I was like, why don't I ever wear berry lipsticks? I don't really know that I want to put on lipstick because, well, I'm just putting on the mask to go to the grocery store, but you just never know, right? I might need it. Okay, I'm going to do this blue liner. It's not the bright one. It's the darker blue, but I feel like it makes my eyes look a little more bright instead of just doing the black. My eyes are very different today. Can you tell that one's really blue and that one's really green? I can really see it in this mirror. I don't always notice it, but I love people who do notice it because most people don't look you in the eye. So especially when people see me in person and they don't notice it, and no, did not look me in the eye, which I'm terrible about looking people in the eye anyway because people are scary. Okay, I see I like the blue. It did um, add a little bit of color without, like a little bit of smoky color without that dark, dark. Cause it's like pink, right? So we don't need all of the black. I need to try the clear lash adhesive. Maybe we'll do that today. Maybe we'll do the blue. Although I'm not really great with liner anymore because I've been using that easy peasy Amazon one. Well, let's be real. I was never good with liner, but here's the thing. 
is I don't feel like makeup artists really follow me. I feel like people who are just trying to like go to the grocery store are following me. It's a huge deal to me. That's funny. Yeah, I'm probably the person that like tries to avoid it because I'm so ridiculous. Because people are scary. And I do really try hard to do it. Um, and I catch myself not doing it and then doing it. But then it's awkward. Here's what's awkward is when someone's staring at your eyes. Like you're staring at their eyes and they're staring at your eyes. And eye contact is just a weird thing, right? No? I don't know. Maybe that's just me. I'm loving this blue liner today. You guys, we are full on all glam for Aldi today. Okay, I gotta show you this color. Hold on, let me get my thumb hold out here. Look at that color. This is the 06 liner. It's so pretty. Cause it's not, I really love this and I want you to get this one too. This one is the 06 in the waterproof. This is just an express pencil. Um, this one is super fun for sure, but this one is kind of nice for like those darker smokier looks. I don't know. So I usually put black up here, but let's just do the blue. Cause then we're going to try out the clear liner lash adhesive. I really like that a lot. I should wear this more often. It's clear that I don't. Let me just show it to you compared to my black. These are the first ones I've, I've never rebought um, eyeliners. And this is it. So they last forever. Okay. So Amazon, I, I've been showing you a million times this lash adhesive from Amazon. It's $6.99. You can get it in a pack of two with a black and a clear for $9.99, which I still think is really good. And I've been using it for a while and it's still going strong. So let's see which one of these is clear. How do you know? How do you know? I don't know. Maybe the end, maybe this one is clear. Let's, let's gamble, throw this one back in or so that I know it's new and try it. Um, actually I need to, let me wash my lashes really quick. The last time I took them off, I didn't really give them the proper care that they needed. So they have some of the liner on them. Actually, we could just wear these other ones. Yeah, let's just wear these other ones. Okay, so look, let me show you these ones. See how like there's some liner on them and stuff? It's just because I didn't clean them. But if I just take my cotton round with my micellar water and just kind of rub it on there, then it's good. Fudge rounds are much better than cotton rounds. Fudge rounds are? Yes. He likes fudge rounds versus cotton rounds. But we're just going to do the glamour ones instead. These still have the super thin lash band, which I like. I actually ordered more lashes so that once these are just thrown away after I've worn them enough, um, I only ordered these two pair. Um, and here's why. These are great. They really are. But you see how they have that black thicker band. I can't wear them all day. They just bother me. Um, I don't know why, but these keep it cool. See how that's really thin. These have some liner on them, but they're real thin like that too. And then these glamor ones. So I ordered more of the magnificent and more of the glamor just because those are my favorite and I can wear them all day long and they don't bother me. They're super thin. Um, it's almost like they don't have a lash line. Okay. So then when you get them, you can cut them. You can do all the things. I think I've done plenty of videos on that, right? Um, but let's try this. Yes, this is definitely clear or white. I don't know. Let's try it. Let's see if it goes on white because otherwise, how are you going to see it? No, it does not go on white. Do we think it's going on? Yes, it's going on. I see it. It looks like just glue. Although I feel like I'm getting color on it from the liner. So maybe this would have been better to do with, um, with a really neutral look. I'm probably going to end up with so much on here. I'm going to glue my eyes shut because I can't see it. So that might be the problem here. 
and I have something in my eyelash. Oh, I forgot. I wanted to try this mascara. Okay. Hold up. Let's try it. Let's try it. Let's try it. This is such a fun tube. I'm not even going to lie. Like, it definitely has this beat, right? Just for packaging alone. <laughs> but I'm still not going to pay $26 for mascara. I'm just not. So, brush looks like this. That's kind of fancy. I like that. Although, it looks kind of weird. Okay. Let's do curl my lashes. I want to give this a real effort. I need some more CC cream from you today. Maybe a couple other things. I'll have to look at your site again. It's been a while. <laughs> you just got your BoxyCharm too. Did you get this palette? It's so amazing. Yes, Megan, just uh, message me so I don't forget. Because I'm going to get off here and then be rushed and cows and I think I go to the grocery store. Although I need to make a list. Do you guys make lists for the grocery store? We literally plan out every meal for the week. Not maybe by day so much, but like, okay, easy meal for when we're busy. Like this meal, this meal. And then we buy exactly what we need for this meal so we don't have food by the weekend. Because we done so. Okay, I like this because there's a lot of product on there. That's the brush. This is kind of weird. Am I gonna get this everywhere? And I'm just gonna put it on like I would any of my other mascaras from the bottom and just roll it up. And then I do the back too, because I wanna give it a fair shake. I don't wanna half ass it and then tell you that it's not as good as mine. Um, yes, I loved the setting spray because I love rose water. I'm a huge rose water fan. Pharmacy has a pure rose line. This mascara is pretty good. If you want to spend $26 on mascara, I would recommend it. It's on, this is only one like really light coat. We're going to do a couple coats just to see. Maybe we won't need our lashes today. I don't know. <sighs> I hate Liberty Walmart. Oh gosh. Yeah, if I were you, I would drive to Excelsior Walmart. That's how much I hate Liberty Walmart and I hate Liberty Aldi. Um, it's literally so terrible that I will be in the city. We'll go to Sam's Club at Liberty and then we'll drive to Excelsior to go to their Walmart and Aldi because um, the uh, Liberty one is so scary. I feel like there's more people there which means more anxiety and nerves and then people are rude and the lines are longer. And uh, here's, here's the real honest thing is I don't know where anything is. They literally have like dog food by chips. That's weird. Dog food belongs by makeup. So I don't know where my reason comes for that, but that's how my Walmart is. And so then whenever I'm like, where's the damn dog food? And they're like, by the chips, I'm like, that doesn't seem right. Should be by the makeup and the fish stuff, you know, and the lawn and garden stuff. I don't know. So I can't find anything there. So that kind of drives me crazy. You guys, this mascara is really good. I'm not even going to lie. I'm not even going to put my lashes on today. And I'm just going to see if it irritates my eyes or how it does. Because it's not terrible. I wanted to hate it. I wanted to say pharmacies is way better. Okay, here's what I'm going to say. Is that our double lash extend will give me this exact same look. And I get it for like 12 bucks. Like half the price, right? So I'm still going to stick with my pharmacy. But this is a fun, nice change. But I did want to try my clear mascara. Should I do the lashes or not? I don't know. I wanted to try that clear liner. There's the mascara, kind of two coats. I am gonna do the lashes just because I want to be bougie like that at Aldi. I mean, I'm gonna probably have to go in there and be like, can I have a card because I don't have a quarter? Because <laughs> that's the story of my life, you all. I don't have a quarter. Okay, so let me try to apply a little bit more of this. I don't have the list done. Um, but I did think about starting the list. So I felt like that was progress and maybe you could just make the list. Add toilet paper to it. Okay, I really wanna try this clear and see if it holds up as well as the black. Cause I haven't tried it yet. I just like, I'm like, I don't know if it's on there. 
I'm probably gonna glue my own lashes to my lid or something crazy because there's so much of this on here. I don't know. Let me just take this makeup wipe from yesterday. It definitely comes off. Okay, let's just see. Okay, let me get my lash. Because so I wanted to see how it looked with the blue. Why do you have to do everything? Because you're so much better at it. I'm such a loser and I'm such a failure and, and you're here to save the day. So just make the damn list. Okay, Dryden needs lunch meat. Don't forget that. Okay, so we'll see if these work as well. The clear, because I can't see it. Like I thought it maybe was gonna go on white and then And then it would dry clear, but no. I mean, they seem attached. Let's check this out. Oh yeah, see, they're glued on, okay. They're on. These are so pretty. So these are my more bougie ones that I really like. They're so pretty. And then, so these are the ones that I really like for like date nights and things like that. I mean, they're not these, y'all. They're not. They're not these full lashes. These are gorgeous. When I put them on, they're gorgeous, but they're kind of heavy. So if I want to wear them to like dinner, um, okay. But if I want to wear them like all day, no, that does not happen. Okay. Let's try this other side with the clear. I'm excited to kind of take some pictures to see if you can see the blue liner or if the glue kind of took the blue liner off. I can definitely kind of feel it because it's sticking to my lashes. But I can't see it, so I'm probably using way too much. So I could definitely see where this one would not last me as long because I'm using more because I can't see it and I want to make sure that my lashes stay on and I don't have one stuck to my cheek in Aldi. Cause that would be weird, right? Literally seems like something that would happen to me, but yeah. So I just kind of bend them a little bit and then put it on. So I kind of press it in the middle and then take my lash tool for the front. Cause then I kind of pull it over and stick it down. But they're so pretty. Melinda, I don't know what you're doing, but it's literally told me that you have joined my Facebook Live like a thousand times. I just keep getting notifications for it over and over. Raining in 46, ugh. That's just too cold. Because then like, is it cold enough for a coat? Do I need my coat? Probably. These lashes are bring life to my whole makeup look. I love it so much. I do want to put on some lipstick just to see a bold berry color. Um, that might be too brown. Here's where, if I'm being honest, we don't have a lot of great liquid lipstick berry colors. We have a lot of browns, nudes, um, some, some pinky mauves. Hmm, let's see what these two colors are. That is a bright, bright pink. Okay, hold on for me one second because with my kit, with your kit, you do get samples. It's $19.99. I can see the glue on here now. Um, I got a full thing. Now they give you just parts of them. Oh, that's a concealer. Okay, let's try to find one of these and see if they work. Okay, so now I think you get like half of this many. I don't know. And you get other foundation and other samples, I guess. Okay. I can't decide which side these are attached to. Okay, this side. I think I have my paper in wrong. Maybe. No, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Okay. Hey, Randy, how's it going? We gotta do grocery shopping today and I'm not looking forward to it. I wanted a really bold berry color, but I'm just not seeing one. Maybe this? This is Instigator? 
Okay, let me see about liners. I just, I'm kind of disappointed right now. I don't know. This isn't very deep. But we're going to try it with the instigator, I guess. This is disappointing. See, this is why I love to try other things because my former pharmacy has some really, really great lipsticks. What is this one? I love the liquids are my favorite. Oh, that one is berry. Oh, look, it just looked brown. Didn't that look brown? Okay, 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 okay. Let's put a little liner on and then let's do that color. But let's do a brown. with that. Maybe I don't wear berry because I didn't think we had one. But don't want to get on the rain. Yeah, I don't want to get out in the rain, but we don't have food in our house. Like, you have all this extra food and can have meals for like a month? No. We have like hot dogs and no buns. We have macaroni salad. And I think we have some expired milk. We're going to die as long as you jack around looking for stuff. I'm not jacking around. I, I literally just watched you jack around trying to find stuff. I can't find it. Boop, but where is it? You know why you can't find it? I'd like to take a a vote right now. Who Dude. thinks I should block Kyle on Facebook so he can no longer critique my lives What's and this? what I'm doing? Hey, those are my nuts. What? What do we got? You got almonds? Okay. You're hiding food in here? Well, no. I don't want to tell you, but I got these free. We'll just leave you it You ordered that. more shit from somewhere. <laughs> and they sent me nuts. For the love of Pete. And they sent me nuts. Where's the box of shit you ordered? I already put it away so you'll never know. <laughs> you could have meals for a couple months. Yeah, no. Oh, I do have... Um, Kyle saw this recipe that was like croissant rolls with cheese and ham, but I think he ate the cheese. So you can't just have ham and a croissant roll. Yeah, because you don't make me food. You make me starve. I literally... Where's my breakfast? It's called the other half of your tenderloin from yesterday. Go eat it. That's lunch. I don't even know. But at the rate you're going, we're going to be in the store at lunchtime. You do this shit on purpose. Cause then we're at the store at lunchtime. Oh, yeah. Do you like this color? It's lunchtime. We're going to go out to eat. I would say I'm kind of the worst about going grocery shopping and then feeling like I need to go to Taco Bell. Because <laughs> I don't know why, but I'm not going to do that today because I am eating better. I still, it's still early. I think so too. Maybe he just feels like that because we lost an hour. Usually on the weekends I wake up around 6 and I couldn't figure out today why I was up at 5. I remember now. Yeah, the time changed overnight. What do you think of the dark? Do you think I should have went lighter? Kyle's gonna say no so that I just wear this, but <laughs> like I already know this mind. about my husband. It's like you read my mind. Um, all up your cheek, and I'd be like, "Yeah, looks great. Let's go. <laughs> looks great. Let's go." Okay. Um, you slept till nine? What? What were your kids doing? Dryden is like sleeps so late. Yesterday was like three o'clock. I'm like, is he awake? He got a new game on Xbox, so he, I think, probably played that on. He said he was up at 11, and he just didn't get out of bed, but I don't really know. Okay. We're going to try this beam color over this lipstick. Right in the center. Oh, yeah, I like this. Sleeping. Oh, I'm still asleep? I don't even know what time it is. Here's the really great thing. You see how just a very little of the lipstick came off where I just applied it because it didn't dry? 
I love the liquid lipsticks because they are really pretty transfer proof. I can hear my live like behind where I'm at. My husband is trying to drive me crazy. Have you made the list yet? Have you made the list yet? 10.07. Okay. Yeah, I like that a whole lot better. It just breaks it up, right? So you can do that with any lipstick and any eyeshadow just to kind of change it up and give it a little ombre look. Okay, there we go. Alrighty. I really like this palette. It was super fun. For my BoxyCharm. If you don't get BoxyCharm and you want to, um, I have a link in my um, bio. In the link tree, it'll have BoxyCharm in there. And it's just super fun because it's like 26 bucks and you get all kinds of fun stuff. Oh, so let's do my setting spray because it smells so good. Mm -mm -mm. Oh, and last month I got this one. This is a hydrating setting mist. But you guys, okay, so you see it right now. Let me just shake it up. Do you see the gold in it? I got that last month. So these are super fun. I really like this one. Like, I don't know that it would be worth buying. Let's see how much it was. Because my setting spray, I think, is like $12.90, I think, $13.90, and I get half of that. This one's $22. So see what I mean? Like, am I going to pay six or seven bucks or $22? Like, this is great, and it smells really good, but my other works great. It's awesome. Love it. You know, see what I mean? Oh, good luck shopping. Yes, getting rained on and wet and all the things, but maybe we should spray a little bit more. This smells so good. Mm. I love the smell of anything rose. It smells so good. Mm -mm -mm. It's not loose. Put my highlighter. So fun. Okay, I'm getting off here so I can make my groceries list because I'm married to a slacker. It's fine. <laughs> Do you hear him laughing? All right. I love you guys. I hope you have an awesome Sunday. Um, enjoy, and I will talk to you guys later. Bye.